What's up everybody, Alex here, and welcome to this match of Dota Underlord Standard in Season 1. How can I not take these guys? So I'm gonna put on... Do I put on Double Bloodseeker? I just might. Do I start with Double Bloodseeker? I'm going to. Yeah, I'm gonna start with Double Bloodseeker. I think I might have... Sh I should have done the, uh, the Double Panda Punch. But here we are. This guy uh, has got a pretty interesting lineup here. I think that um, he's got a lot of single target deletion, which is kind of terrifying because Crystal Maiden and Shadow Demon can really do work here. Are we going to get the win here? I think we will. One of these guys is going to take the Demonic Purge, and the other one should go on to win this fight. This guy's the real winner. He's only going to take one damage. He's the real winner. All right, so what am I doing today? Well, of course, we're going to be responsive to uh, RNG, but... Uh, do I say it out loud? You guys know who I want to three star. I've been chasing three star Luna for like what? An entire week? Just chasing the three star Luna. I don't even care about any other other uh, units. I, I don't. I just want a three star Luna. I'm going to roll so aggressively that you guys will be begging me. Literally begging me to stop rolling. You're going to be like, Alex, please. You're throwing the game. Stop rolling. And I'm not going to listen. I'm going to keep rolling. And that'll be that. Now, what I might actually do here is actually sell him and roll. I, I, I might sell everyone and roll. I still don't have a Luna. That might be crazy. That might be absolute anarchy. I don't know if I can do that. So we got the win. Two wins in a row. Good job. And um, we are going to sell off literally everybody. Because I want Luna. Give me Luna. No, I'm not taking it. Give me. Yes, now we can play. Now we can play the game. Thank you, game. It's all I wanted. It's all I wanted. You got to be difficult, and I don't appreciate it. Yeah, Luna, you can tank. <laughs> She's going to go down so fast. Can we keep our win streak alive? That is the question. We are not going to keep this win streak alive. We are going to get absolutely dummied here. Yep, we're going to lose. At least we took down somebody. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not too concerned about it. Because right now... Do we have the only ones with Luna? Okay, we're the only ones with Luna. I can do that. We got our mages. I'm very happy with that. In my rampage earlier, I didn't have to sell off any uh, any mages. So I'm not too concerned. Because I am doing my Luna mage build. It's that or bust. I simply do not care. Might even take Batrider for now. No, actually. No. Mages and Luna or bust is what I said, damn it, and that's what I'm doing. Okay. Now with Luna, the sweet spot's gonna be the next level. So I could have leveled there. I probably could have, probably should have. But I also want to get up to 30 so I can maximize my ability to reroll hyper aggressively. And hopefully, you know, all these bloodbound guys causing problems. Bloodbound always causing problems. Bloodbound really falls off late, though. Generally speaking. Generally speaking. I might actually just take this level. Yeah, I'm going to. I want the additional chance to pull Luna right now. That's what I want. We didn't even have anyone else to put on anyway. And I wouldn't have dropped past 10, so... It is fine. It is absolutely fine. I am going to take... I'm always baited by Armlet. I am. I am always am baited by Armlet. I'm not taking it. I have to take care here, I think. Yeah, I take care. Deso's good too. Deso's good too. Oh, look at the Bat Riders. Just coming around just to poke fun at me for selling him before. Okay. Take this. Yeah, this is fine. I'm happy with this lineup. Let's go. We can beat these guys. Oh, Tiny 2 with a headdress of all things. The guy picked a headdress. I can respect that. 
Especially with all, uh, all warriors. We're oh, that razor's not gonna do much damage, unfortunately. Come on. This guy's gonna get us good, too. Wow! Are we even gonna take someone down? <gasps> we didn't take it down a single unit. Six damage round six. Way too much. Way too much. Nah, I don't want to try. Got some brown- eh, you know what? I was gonna say we got some brown brownies. We got brownies! Jim Jam, running brownies. Good job, man. Good job. Okay, so Lifestealer is part of my build. We're gonna level the next two rounds. Hold on to Lifestealer. Lifestealer would be next in. Now, we're not getting crazy RNG or anything. We are seeing some contention, which sucks. But... I actually think we're getting the composition we need. Getting the losses here isn't that big a deal. Wow, this guy's a great lineup. This is an unbelievable lineup. Wow. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Let's shift over one here. Just thinking. Let's, look at, let's check contention here while we're sitting... For my last place, of course, Razor's contested. Contested. Trying to. Trying to. J it's Jim Jam. Damn it, Jim Jam. Wow. Oh, contested. So we are running some contested units here. That helps. Being at 28 breaks my heart. Do I s uh, selling life stealer is too much a risk. So we're going to cost ourselves interest here. Because Life Stealer's next in on the next round, we have to. I don't want to sell the Luna either. I'm not selling the Luna. I cannot do that. Look at this. Everyone's going Bloodbound. It's like, it's like a few patches ago where you couldn't stop people from building Bloodbound, and now it's back. Oh, Maiden, we needed you to take down this damn Bloodseeker. He's already got 10 kills. Bloodseeker does fall off a bit, but late game, he's, he's not great. He's not great. We were going to win that anyway, so I didn't uh, cost myself some interest. We're going to take the level here. You're on, friend. You're going to go here, actually. Engage late. You know what? I'm actually... It's going to sacrifice some interest here, but I don't think we're going to win this round. So I'm actually going to roll here down to about 20. Come on, game. Not what we need. Okay. I mean, we need those units. But I was hoping to two-star, uh, someone of note. Gloves of Haste should be on Lifestealer. So that's a mistake on my, my, uh, behalf there. This guy's gonna get us again! We're off to a rough start! It is a rough start here. But, I'm not too concerned. I think we can still make it. I'm a little sad we haven't seen much of uh, Luna yet. But the other guy hasn't either. We're the only one trying to get Luna right now. This is the game. This is the game where I do it. Three-star Luna. I have to. I just have to. Can't blink. Arcane Voots is... I'm actually going to take the boots. Vanguard is a fantastic item as well. I'm going to shift over one. Take our roll. Yes. Switcheroo. Give him that. Okay. We have to stop losing. That's the problem. The problem is we're losing too much. Also, I got to get above 30 so I can safely roll with interest. We haven't been there, and I'm not willing to sell those guys off. So Lifestealer did a good job there. We might actually be able to get a win here. Targeting buddy is distracting us, and now we're gonna lose. Damn it. Ooh, how do you like that love tap, Razor? And you're dead. <gasps> maiden versus Maiden. Mine's gonna man up first. Yes. Come on. No! How d Oh, mana boots. But she's gonna have enough mana too. Oh, no! I need a better crew. That was embarrassing. Queen of Pain could be a good fill in here. I might actually hold the Queen for a sec. Then again, I'm not taking her until I level. 
going friendly now, fire here. You got to look at I just like friendly fire Hobgen, okay? Just I like what he's doing. I like what he's doing in the game right now. Now, realistically, the only one accepting the mana is Razor anyway, so meeting can be on the edge. doesn't matter. Can we take Storm? We sell her. These guys, everyone getting two stars except me. Take Storm. Take the... Oh, yeah, that's beauty. That's a beauty right there. Okay. Luna's got to come out. No. Mm. Yeah, Luna comes out. Luna has to come out there. Got to play smart. Let's go on behind. Got to play smart. Now, also at the same time, Lifestealer should not be tanking like that. Come on, Hobgen. Give us some love. Let's go. There it is. Get that damn Razor. Razor's going to beat us, unfortunately. Not Razor. Viper. Damn you, Viper. Damn you. Okay. We're still in good shape, though. But how is it? There's Luna back. Last hit. Trying to chase Luna. I don't appreciate that. I just don't. He's got to come in later. Got to roll, got to roll, got to roll. Come on, game, come on! Yes. I like Morphling better here. Come on, don't disappoint me. Get that win, let's go. We're against the last hit. We got to beat this guy. We got to send him a message. Oh, he two-star Luna, damn it! Two-star Luna. Oh, we're totally going to lose here. Uh... Hobgen might do some work for us here. Oh, there's a lot of friendly firing happening right now. But, guess who won? We did. We won. And it was because of our life stealer. What a beauty. What an absolute beauty. And he got us the interest there. We got a uh, brawny build here. The, br the brownies. We got the brownie build. And, um... I think we can do something about that. Life stealer is going to help us with that. No problem. Let's go. Okay, that's good. So he's in. I'm actually gonna give him the KO. And we're gonna roll. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay. Come on. Damn it. RNG really does hate me. It really does. Come on. And we find out if we can be Bradford. Is that Bradford bartender? Can't tell. And unfortunately, our life stealer is dead because of the uh, Viper toxin there. There's friendly fire. Help us, though. Come on. Oh, no. It was a good fight. That was close. That was close. All right. Let's check contention one more time here. So, we do have some contention here, but I'm kind of it. I think I'm gonna chase. I think I'm gonna chase the ogre magi, honestly. So is that guy. Damn it! So I don't think I can chase ogre magi. So I take mask of madness. Has to go here. This goes here. Now we have something scary right here. Realistically, oh, it breaks my heart. Let's see what we get here. Come on. Gotta keep rolling. We're really blowing up our economy here. We're getting punished. My plans are coming to fruition. Okay. I made that choice. Because she was a good next in. And because I feel like we are not remaining that competitive on the board. People are getting three stars, we're not. We needed we needed to do that. We need to conserve our health cuz rerolling like crazy. I did promise you guys absolute anarchy with rerolling. But at the same time, he's on fire. We need to make sure that we're being reasonable. Got to be reasonable. How do I do this? 
we just ever so slightly moved out of the sweet spot for tier two. But we're uh, moving towards the sweet spot of tier three and life stealer. So do I, I maybe I push to seven. Maybe I push to seven. He's uncontested. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna push to seven and then we're gonna roll. I'm going after three star Razor and I'm gonna, I don't care. I'm going after three star Ogre Magi. I can get rid of the, uh, I can get rid of the uh, the Crystal Maidens if I need to. Cooldowns, I mean, cooldown helps here. But it's not the major thing. Life Stealer is kind of like, it's all on Life Stealer right now. In a Mage build, by the way. In a Mage build. Life Stealer is who I want to three star in a Mage build. And I know that a lot of people think I'm crazy. Because I might be. But, I'm telling you right now, the Life Stealer in this build is a, is a genuinely good, uh, genuine good call. 100%. No question. No question, and he's uncontested. And the brute bonus helps. Okay, no luck. Yeah, we gotta push to seven. We might be the first to seven. We push to seven. We aim for three stars here, here, and here. And of course, with our friend Luna. We are going to slightly fall out of the, uh, the sweet spot though. 30% still enough, I'll take it. Okay, this guy beat up on us pretty good last time. All these warriors. Come on, Hobbion. Now, thankfully, they're not doing a lot of damage. And Life Stealer, you're going to see him jump up a bit. Because remember, he's healing for a percentage of their health. And they have a lot of health. Hobbion's down. Come on, Life Stealer. He's taking a little too much damage, but he's healing a lot because he's attacking Pudge right now. But it's not going to be enough. Okay, we took down that jug there. Great. Good job. Good job. I was actually, you know what? We lost that fight. But I'm really happy with what I saw. Really happy with what I saw. Okay, come on. Ah, oh, Slark. No one's even going Assassin's game as I predict every single time. Gotta take that Keeper. Yeah, we gotta take You'll Keeper here. Keeper comes in here for her, I think. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do this. Okay. I don't want to sell off Maiden. She's still part of the plan. But remember, we do want to get to six... We do want to get to six uh, mages here. Now, in this situation, Luna can come out. And Morphling... And it's not worth putting Morphling... We have to get to seven. Morphling would be the next in. With Luna coming out for Crystal Maiden. It would really amplify the damage potential of Hobgin as well. Like, for instance, he would have killed all those guys. Ideally, we push in two rounds, but I think I might take it early. I think I might take it early. Okay. I like Yules here. I'll take the tree. Okay. I'll take the tree. It's, it's a greedy level. It's a greedy level. I know that. We got six. Oh no! So that means I'm not going to 3 star Ogre Magi until he's knocked out. Until that guy gets knocked out, I can't 3 star Ogre Magi. So let me just think here, BHL, let's see if he wins this fight. Let's see how hard he gets hit. It's going to help me determine what I do. We're going to win this fight. No we're not. No! He has to lose. He has to lose. He's losing but not by much. We need him to get really throttled. He did not get throttled. Okay. Thank you, Slaughter, for surviving. He's at 32 health, so I'm actually going to hold on to my Ogre Magi. Because once this guy goes out, those Magi are mine. They're mine. That's disappointing. 
We're in the sweet spot for uh, for Life Stealer, though. We're there. We are there, and I'm gonna take it. This is where we roll. Come on. Come on, RNG. You know you want to help us, RNG. Hey, I'm gonna roll right down to 20. Okay, taking that. Fine. Okay. Okay. Storm, I believe, is uncontested right now. He's doing a similar build. Storm is uncontested. Is this guy trying to get Storm? He's not even trying to get Storm. He's holding on to a Keeper. He's at level 6. We're at 7. So only a few people are at 7. We're against him! We gotta give him a beating. We have to give him a beating. Keeper, come on. Friendly Fire's gonna come down. We got him. We got him. That was a horrible cast by Keeper. But Life Stealer's not going down for no one here. Life Stealer's not losing this fight. Good. Get out of here. What am I gonna see? What am I gonna say? Oh, I don't wanna say anything too mean. No, not bristle back. I want Luna. Damn it, I want three star Luna. It's not gonna happen again. I can feel it. It's not gonna happen again. Do I have do I have to cry on camera for, for three star Luna? Game, why do you gotta do this to me? Why you gotta do this to me? Okay. Alright. We know he's uncontested. We know he's uncontested as well. We can do those three stars. Come on. We're at six mages. I'm not selling Luna. I do not care. I'm not going to sell her. I still got hope. Come on, Hobgin. Let's see that damage spike up on Hobgin. This guy's been beating up on everyone. Do we finally got him or what? We are going to beat him. And it's Storm Spirit, Hobgin, and Keeper of the Light of all people. Hey, 30 auto attack damage. Good job, Keeper. Well done. I love it. I absolutely love it. 30 auto attack damage. Like, what were you doing that whole time? Like, what's he doing? What's he doing? Nothing, obviously. Okay. We stay at 30. We lock in, we're middle of the pack, we're okay. BHL might be on his way out. I like our positioning here, I want him on the safe edge. More flame. Oh, look at this guy, just contesting everyone, are ya? And you got my razors. And Keeper of the Light, you're not even using them. We're against him again. We gotta, we gotta beat him. We gotta beat him, let's go. No multicast on the uh, on the Ogre Magi. That's some decent RNG here. Look at Lifestealer just chewing away at these guys. Lifestealer is going to be a problem for him. Well, we got the uh, we got the relocate off. Oh, he brought back the Ogre Magi again. No way. Lucky pull. We almost took him down too. But look at this. Lifestealer is not going down. No, attack the Ogre Magi, you fool. Yes. Look at this. What a close fight, but as long as we're beating this guy, that's all that matters. He's on fire! He even had a mango tree. We got a mango we got a mango tree. Our mangoes are riper. They're healthier. And quite frankly, um, they're just better. Not Vlad's. I'll take uh, BKB. I'm not thrilled about BKB. You gotta be kidding me. Everyone's everyone's on point right now. Except for ooh. Is this our moment? So close. So we overfill the board. We're gonna take him. Three star him. What a beauty. Come on, let's do this. Let's do this. You guys got to feel this, right? You feel it. You feel it coming. We might actually get a three-star Luna. We're in good shape. Look at this. Three stars everywhere. It's out of control. <gasps> no! Our wind condition's down. 
This guy's beating up on us pretty hard. Oh, we're gonna take a lot of damage. 13 damage, that's way too much to take. So this guy is a problem. And it was a ghost. I might roll down here. I might just roll here. Let's go. Let's go. Helpful. Helpful. How's this guy doing? Do I have to saw off my Ogre Magi, damn it? Oh! He won! Against Warrior Guy. Ogre, unfortunately, I have to sell the Magi. If I, if I have to pick someone, it's him. Gotta take Keeper, gotta hold on to Keeper. Come on. There it is. I really debated how to min-max those rolls. And thankfully, that ended up working out. He's got a Kea. He's gonna be able to do work. He's not hitting the people we want him to hit. There you go, Hobbian. Keep going, Spirit. Keep going, make me proud. There it is. We, we just need to win fights here. Look at this tiny! He's a monster! He's hitting the tree? How rude. Oh! It's a battle of one titan and one little little guy. One little electric dude. Who's gonna win? Big angry guy did. Alright, big angry guy won. Fair enough. Okay. How much damage can one man do to his economy? I think I gotta stay. I don't think I, I can roll here. I gotta bank on a win. Oh, man. Look at this. Look at the RNG. Look at it. Look at this board. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? Not exactly what I was hoping. We can't beat that guy. We know this. Could we beat this guy? With this three-star Bloodseeker. Oh. Huge disruptor cast. Look at that. Storm Spirit damage. Hobgins friendly fire coming down. Storm Spirit's still alive. Look at that. We should get this win. Come on. There you go. There you go. And last hit's out. Last hit had knights. He had some lunas. Lunas are back in the shop. 50 seconds. I'm going to cut you ahead to round 24. All right, let's see how we do here. Come on, let's go. It's Jim Jam. Jim Jam's got quite the lineup here. Uh oh, we're in trouble. We're getting hit pretty hard. Oh, we're going down hard. No. Oh, no. This is bad. This is really bad. Okay, we got to survive. 40 seconds to round 25. I'm going to cut you ahead. All right, I'm definitely digging Moon Shard. Fantastic item all the way around. Could even put on Life Stealer here, honestly. Yes, I might. We're against a brawny team. You know what? No. Keep this on him. Moon Shard. We'll give it over here. You know what? No, no. We'll Moon Shard him. No, 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 no. The ball lightning's worth two. You know what? No, it's not really. I Moon Shard over here is fine. Okay, we'll take the Morphling. Come on, game. Okay, we're going to stay here for now. Actually, the brawny guy gives us... You know what? Yeah, do doing this. Oh, I didn't have time to move the moon shard over. It's okay. So we got two life stealers in. Life stealers should have moon shard. But then again, moon shard on, uh, on the storm spirit. It does amplify his DPS. I think the Kea is probably better there. So Kea on the storm spirit. Moon shard on the... Uh, on the life stealer is the correct call, so I'm gonna make that change in a moment. There we go. I mean, it is helping him right now. Good job. Good job. Good win. Good win. Okay. So we're gonna take this morphling as well. So we're at eight now. So we're gonna life stealer. Give him that. Switch him up like this. Kea over here. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Fourth place. Luna is not even in. 
Luna is not even in. I think I'm gonna roll right down. Do I roll right down or I get back? No, I roll right down. Let's go. Luna or bust. Luna or bust. Okay. Okay, helpful. I'm gonna take her out. Yeah. I don't care. No Lunas! Absolute madness. Double life stealer though. Here we go. Double life stealer. Let's go. So this is good. He has a tanky lineup. Life stealer is going to be able to. Both of them are going to be able to do a lot of work here. I suspect the one that is with the moon shard should survive a little longer. There's the BKB. I feel like it's a bit wasted on someone like the uh, the ogre, but it's okay. We got the win. We got the win. That's what we needed. Let's go. Jim Jam taking 12 damage as well. This guy is really... <laughs> that's, he's got Heart of Tarask and everything there. He's really doing well. Really doing well. Let's go. Come on. Okay, Life Stealer. I will take Life Stealer all day long. I'm rolling right down because I do have guys to sell. We also need to keep her the light. We also need to keep her the light. Just thinking, how do we switch this up? I don't think we do. He has to be there. We might actually do this. BKB, Razor. Okay. Could BKB Morphling as well? He has a really fast attack rate. You know what? I think I'm going to move. I'm going to just do it now so I don't forget. It's Jim Jam. Kind of wish I had Enigma against Jig, uh, Jim Jam. And I also passed on a... Uh, what's it called? Cadence at one point. But it's because I think we can beat this guy. And we can. We definitely can. We're on He's fire on here. Fire. We're on fire. We're doing good. We're doing good. Okay. We're off of meeting. We got the lich in there. Okay, we take okay, here we go. Come on. Come on. Alright. I don't want to just sell off the Morphling right now, because I think we might be able to actually 3-star him. Okay. I kind of like our positioning. I might even... I want him later to the fight. I want him later to the fight. So this guy's been causing problems for us. Oh, he's stuck! No! Mistakes were made! Anyways, okay, that actually ended up working out for Lifestealer. He's, he's getting hit pretty hard. This guy's a Tarrasque. He's stunned as well. Wow. Hobgin, get the cast. He did. He got the cast. I was going to say, was that Legion Commander just not going to die? Like, what was happening there? Absolute anarchy. Okay. We're in third place. We're in third place. Come on. We are so close. One away from three-star Lifestealer. That's exactly what we need. And two away from a Morphling. Taking Vesture. Vesture here. Boots here. BKB there. Let's take the free reroll. Come on! Life Stealer. Come on, game. Help me out. No! Why are you doing this to me? Oh. Can't. It makes me sad, but what am I going to do? Could have put Life Stealer in the inside there. We find out who we can beat here. Come on. The Vestures is going to do work here, thankfully. I don't know if it's going to be enough. We got a lot of value from Vestures. And BKB keeping Morphling up. We're going to beat this guy. Yes. How about this guy? What's up over here? And he beat us. He beat us. So Jim Jam can beat us. Okay. It's good to know. Oh, passing on two double axe in the shop. It hurts. Oh, there's Keeper again. How are you, Keeper? Thanks for thanks for coming out. You absolute clown. Look at this. I gotta lock this shop. Okay. Let's 
make a couple switches here. It's nothing. It's not enough. Okay. Jim Jam's ghost. We know he can beat us. Is he gonna beat us by 17? Life stealers are taking too much damage here. They're the ones we really need to carry us right now. They're on vestures though. Come on, Storm Spirit. Come on, Hobgin. There's the cast. Storm Spirit's gonna go down before his next cast. Okay, one health. Wow. That bristleback I thought was gonna be the one to take us down. Okay, here's our moment. Let's go. Come on, game. You owe this to us. You owe this to us. This is crazy. I've been trying to get three star Luna for like two weeks. Come on. No. I gotta sell one of these guys. I don't wanna sell. It's Morphling I sell. No, it's Lifestealer I sell. It's Morphling. I can't do it. No double Morphling in the shop. No. Okay. I might have an actual heart attack. It's Jim Jam again. Okay. Okay, so the uh, we got our casts off before. Oh, this is my, not going to make a difference. RNG, why have you forsaken me? It's third place. Wow. That was... I can't believe I still have a three-star Luna. I still cannot believe it. That was a good game. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. I'm actually so distraught with the, my, my RNG. Oh, no. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And a very special thank you to all of my wonderful subscribers. Take care, everyone, and have yourselves an absolutely wonderful day.